Hello everyone, in this video I want to show you how you can create a background for your Flutter app. So basically I have here right now a black background and I've created this design here. And to make it more stylish we have a package which is called Flutter Blur Hash. So we can go to pub.dev and type it here inside Flutter Blur Hash and then we can go here inside and go directly to the installing section and copy this one and put it here into our pubspec jumble file in our project under dependencies we put here this flutter blur hash inside like i did it here with this package you can basically take an image and blur it and this will create for you a hash and this hash you can use in your application. So we can use it for example for this image here to create a hash and then show it instead of this image while it is loading. Or you can also show like the whole background with this hash color. Yeah, let's get just started. So first of all, we like to go here to our main and here I have created this build cover. So this is the whole design of this page. And yeah, you can just take your design. And what we want to do here is now we want to wrap this here into a stack. So we take here a column and replace it here with the stack. And now we have here this package blur hash or this widget from this package and we can import it here. And now we have to supply here a hash. And I will here just put one inside so that you know, okay, you can, for example, have here this hash and then it will have this cool effect and it changes your screen. So here's a little black, here's also a little bit darker and then here some blue, here's some other color and everything out of this hash. And how does this work? So basically you can go to their website. So you go here to the Flutter package and then you can go to this website here. And if you load this up, you can click on get started. And if you scroll here down, you can upload an image. So I will upload, for example, right now here, this image, which is exactly the same one. And if you do this, he will generate for you a hash. So this is this hash here and you simply can copy this and just replace it here. So I will put it here inside and I also keep the other one inside. So if you like this hash, you can also use this one. So I put it here inside and then just hot reload the application. And you see we have immediately like a totally different design. And this is because of this hash, which we created with this image. And you can put it here as a background. You can also create other hashes from other images. So I also have here, for example, this one. So this is more like a different design uh, which you also can use. So you can take every image which you like and generate this hash for you. What you also can do is you can create this hash on your server so you can talk to their API and then they will create this from your image, you upload an image to this API and they will generate it for you. And then you store it with your image on the server. And while the image is loading, you simply show here this hash in this image. And if this image is then loaded, then it will display this one here. So this is also what you can do. So instead of setting it here directly as a background, we can set it here for this image. So let's try this out. So I will just go here to our image. I just comment this image right now out and here inside I put then this blur hash and I take exactly the same hash which we have here generated for this image. And if we hot reload this application, you will see that we have here this hash, which is exactly this hash of this image. And this is what you can show until this image is, for example, displayed in your application if you like this. I don't like this so much. I like to use it more for the background so you can do it here. I will keep it inside. So if you download this repository, you can simply use it. But I like this option more that you have here in the background something. And yeah, you can simply try it out with your images, try different hashes out. If you like one, then keep them. And with this, you can easily create a great design and you don't need to do a lot about it. Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel here to get the latest news about Flutter and see you soon. Bye!